Greetings, Wanderer. If you made it this far, congratulations. Not very many people do. This audio cassette will cover the various groups of the back rooms. When you are done with this audio cassette, please stop and rewind the audio cassette for the next person, please. Back Rooms Remodeling Company Is your back rooms level looking drab and old? Are your carpets soggy and wallpaper peeling? Call now at and we'll fix the place right up. You can always rely on Backrooms Remodeling and Furniture Company to get the job done. Backrooms Remodeling Company, a mysterious and confusing military whose sole purpose seems to be to remodel, remake, refurbish, or otherwise improve the back rooms. Despite the results of their efforts being more than questionable, they're rather friendly and try their best. Backrooms Robotics Welcome to the world of tomorrow, or the people of today, in the land of unlimited potential. We here at Backrooms Robotics are here to make your life in this strange new world easier and better than ever. Take for instance the Backrooms Robotics brand lamps, a quick and easy way to light up those hard-to-see areas, with unlimited functionality. Have a mess that just won't come out of that damp, damp carpet? Try one of our new Backrooms Robotics brand mobile vacuum cleaners for no-work cleanups. From monorails to AI, and much, much more, Backrooms Robotics is the one and only supplier of premium consumer goods for you. Stop in at one of our stores in Level 522, Level Acromatomaly, or Level Acromatopsia. Backrooms Robotics is a mass-producing tech company which helps out around the back rooms. Many tech-related items inside of the back rooms are developed by this mysterious group. Their intentions are somewhat unclear, however. Their products each indicate a specific goal. They have been known to dabble in all forms of technology, ranging from grunt technology like lamps and mobile vacuum cleaners to AI and complex machinery, such as Coco. As they seem to have misguided morals, it is unrecommended to trust them, as they have been known to have vague connections to certain unsavory groups. The BNTG Whatever happens in the keep, stays in the keep. No word gets out of here once you're in. Collect anything you can from anyone. Keep your eye on the prize and glory will be yours. The BNTG Backrooms Non-Aligned Trade Group is a group once created by the MEG, until it grew independent. The group itself is made up of various mercenaries and assassins which all have a diverse selection of resources to trade to just about anyone. The group is led by a persona known as the Keeper. No one knows for sure who this person is, or if they even exist at all. But there is enough evidence from the likes, if initials on messages to show that someone is pulling the strings. Their main base is known as Trader's Keep, where they have set up apartment-like rooms in Level 1 for people to stay and be protected by their skilled members. The items that they collect are stored in Trader's Vault, a large anomalous hallway of garage doors that have many various items stored inside. The BNTG holds many secrets beyond the keep, and it is suggested to keep quiet if you ever join the group. What goes in never tends to come back out. The Eternal Repository Forever Loyal, Forever Eternal The Eternal Repository was founded in 2016 by a man named Victor Ballantin, with the goals of anonymity and informational bartering. As of today, they are still a mysterious group with a member count estimated in a few thousands. Information about them is hard to come by, and everything provided is what they permit to release to the public. The Eyes of Argos We protect those who cannot protect themselves. We avenge those who could not be protected, and we judge those who can be forgiven. We are the judges, the jurors, and the executioners of this inhospitable land. Beware of us, because our eyes are always watching. The Eyes of Argos are the self-proclaimed vigilantes of the back rooms. They operate divided into five distinctive patrols, each of them exercising justice in their own unique way, but all sharing the main objective of purging criminals from the back rooms. This goal does not exude any group of interest which has given them many enemies among the most influential factions. The Followers of Jerry You are here for a reason. 
You have been chosen, because you are wonderful and beautiful. Jerry loves you more than you can ever know, if you choose ignorance. But you can know. May the wingspan of a thousand feathers protect us in his embrace. Forevermore shall his followers live in harmony and euphoria. Father Bluebird be with us. Come to level 2. The followers of Jerry will be waiting. He is waiting. The followers of Jerry is a religious doomsday cult that is led by one Father Bluebird, made up of both humans and entities that worship the entity known as Jerry. Their main goal is to indoctrinate all life in the back rooms into the cult. All hail Jerry. The Kallic Institute Welcome to the Kallic Institute, the everlasting archives for those who came before us. We are happy to give assistance to anyone who needs access to our archives. Do remember to inquire the senior archivist prior. The Kallic Institute is an institute of immortal archivists who record, organize, and archive information on every death in the back rooms. They are a secretive group that guards our archives with fervor. The Institute has created a public archive accessible to outside groups or individuals with files and exploration logs related to the back rooms and its dangers. It is not best to ask them about the nature of the Institute. They will never give you an actual answer. The Lost The Lost are a peoples made of culture and respect. Our history is as old as the back rooms itself hearkening back to the earliest days of mankind and civilization. Honor and wisdom await us. The Lost are an ancient group of multiple civilizations, dating back to the earliest days of history. They have since been forgotten by time in the back rooms, with one goal unifying them all, to be remembered. The MEG We are the glimmer of hope. We are the MEG. We promise to protect everyone we possibly can and explore the extraordinary places no one has ever seen before. We will keep you safe. The MEG Major Explorer Group, is currently the largest faction in the back rooms, created with the goal of finding an escape. It is divided into small teams, focusing on various tasks such as exploring, mapping out areas, and terminating hostile entities. The group is run by the Overseers a team of three that watches over the various teams and holds the most knowledge. The MEG has created a publicly accessible database to inform backroom denizens on how to identify and deal with the backroom's various anomalies. Every day a new discovery is made. They are not perfect, but no one is. They will find a way out. The Masked Maidens More often than not, masks were seen as a means of deception. But upon our faces are masks that intend to only define the truth. We, the Masked Maidens, are a product of deception, betrayal, and corruption. It will be us who will bring it down, through any means necessary. To mask is to reveal. Starting as the product of a failed experiment run by unknown corrupt members within the MEG, the Masked Maidens are a group dedicated to bringing down the corrupted weeds, infecting what are meant to be good groups divided into nine unique sectors, and scattered across hidden stations across the levels of Cluster 1. They are constantly growing in number, even going as far as forming hidden alliances to achieve their goal. As such, comes a single wish from them all. May your truth be unmasked. The UEC Unbound by fear, united by bravery. We are the only way for man to persist, despite the conditions. It is our cause to expand and fabricate the perfect utopia so that no foul beast will bring harm to any ever again. The UEC is a group founded by a former MEG member named Diana Stewards, an entity biologist who had lost her family in an entity attack. Her original vision of the UEC was contorted by her followers into a genocidal tirade, and since had developed powerful and dangerous weaponry to take over the back rooms at any cost. 